Hey there, it's Ryan Haley. And today I wanted to come to you with our October look at the real estate market here in Worcester County. Um, the Maryland Association of Realtors today just released their stats for the entire state uh, for this past month here in October of 2019. And uh, being here in Ocean City and at the beach in our office being uh, right in Midtown Ocean City, I always have a tendency to focus on the Worcester County stats uh, before I look at any place else in the state. And I just thought I thought I would share those numbers with you today. I'm, I'm seeing some interesting, uh, interesting numbers and some things that I, I thought I would point out. Um, the first thing I look at is a lag measure, something that has already happened in the past, and that is our settlements. So this is obviously uh, nothing moving forward, but it's our history and the settlements for October, many of which those contracts were written in either late August or early September, um, show a decline this month, show a decline for October. So settlements were down 17.8%, which is a pretty big number. Um, in 2018, uh, 236 properties sold here in Worcester County, as opposed to this year, 194. So we saw settlements slip up um, considerably, which is interesting because uh, at the same time, our interest rates have gotten better. But uh, moving forward, one thing I like to look at is what is our inventory right now and what are our pending stats? So if you actually look for the month of October, the month of October was actually a little bit stronger as far as buyers writing offers uh, and getting properties under contract than it was a year ago. In fact, we were up uh, this year, we had 219 properties go under contract in October as opposed to the 213 last year. Uh, another thing I find interesting is what are prices doing? You know, is there a reason that um, the number of settlements were down? Was it that pricing got too high or have they remained flat? And um, as I reported in our last marketing uh, market recap report, prices are up about 3%, just over 3%, 3.1 compared to last year at this time with our average sales price right now at 297000 for the entire town of Ocean City. So what's for sale? How much do we have for sale? How much is there to choose from? And this, I feel, is the biggest reason that we saw a decline in the overall settlements for October. Total inventory in 2019 stands at 1,057 properties for sale in the entire county. That's from Delaware to the Virginia line uh, here on the coast in, in Worcester County, 1,057 properties for sale. Compare that to last year, we had 1,317 properties for sale. That's a 20% decrease in the available homes for sale in, in a year's time. So what does that mean? There's less to choose from. So I personally feel that there's equal demand, if not slightly increasing demand, based on the fact that our interest rates are so low. But when those buyers go into the marketplace and you're trying to find properties that are compelling, that show well, that are priced accurate, they're having a hard time finding it due to lack of inventory. So I feel the lack of inventory inventory has artificially kept our number of settlements down, um, especially for October here. Um, but moving forward, the measure we look at, um, which is a lead measure, things that will happen in the future, our pending sales are up just a tad. So that, that leaves us with 5.1 months of inventory. So if no properties came on the market from this point forward, we would have five months to sell everything we have in the current inventory. Now, we obviously know that's not the case. Every day there's new properties coming on the market. There's new properties going under contract. There's new properties set, actually settling. So 5.1 months of inventory, compare that to last year. And uh, last year at this time, we had 6.8 months. So that's down a little bit. Um, all in all, a very healthy market. We'll have to continue to see what happens here in the fall with November and December stats as far as settlements. I think we're going to see those rebound when we compare the year over year average, um, especially with the interest rates remaining at a, at a low number. So wanted to share that information with you. That's the market report here for Worcester County. Uh, if there's ever anything I can do for you to answer any questions specifically about different neighborhoods, Ocean City, Ocean Pines. I'd be happy to do that for you. So hope you are having a great day and I look forward to speaking with you next time. Take care.